Greetings Sports DTM fans and welcome to another episode of Sports Down the Middle, the channel of undiluted sports content. Now, the Olympics is pretty much on us. We at Sports DTM will be looking on the 200 meters for women. Now, we have the top 8 fastest time for this year. However, a lot of these ladies did not qualify to represent their country in the 200 meter and some decided to call it early on their season. Like, for example, uh, Brianna Liston, you know, she had a fast time of 22.31 seconds. She called it early for the season. So let's get into it. The fastest time for this year, and the person that comes in with a world lead, is Gabrielle Thomas of US. She ran a time of 21.78 seconds. This was done on June 8, 2024. Gabrielle Thomas looks threatening. She's no stranger to running fast times coming into a big championship. But can she deliver running those rounds and going up against strong competition? Can she deliver and finish with at least a goal? And at number two, Mackenzie Long, also of USA. She ran a time of 21.83 seconds. So another sub 22 seconds runner here. She had done that on June 8, 2024. Pretty much a newcomer to the scene, uh, running in a major championship. Does she have what it takes? Can she continue to run sub 22, you know, up against strong competition? Let's see what she has in store. And at number three, Julian Alfred. She means business. She ran a time of 21.86 seconds. And she continued to improve her 100 meters time is no slouch. She's a strong person who tends to fight to the finish and give pretty much their all on the track. She ran that mark 21.86 on July 20, 2024, so just recently. So she's coming into the championship with a lot of race under her belt and competition. So she will be able to stave off any competition, especially given her experience for this year. And at number four, another sub 22 here, Brittany Brown. 21.90 seconds. This was done on June 29, 2024. She may have what it takes to make it to the finals. Not certain what would happen if she would get on a podium. Running sub 22 is very impressive, but I'm not certain if the rounds would put some pressure on her and she might not be able to capture that sub 22 in the finals, hence putting her on the podium because you know to medal. You have to actually dip below 22 and, and possibly 21.7. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that that's a mark to ensure that you find yourself on the podium. Coming in at number five, cousin Dina Asher-Smith. Um, she has a mark of 22.07 seconds. I mean, she's a sub-22 person, naturally. Um, she had run that time on July 20, 2024. She left it late in a sense, but she may just run it into form now. And so we are expecting her to make it to the finals and possibly ending up on the podium. And number six, Daryl Nita, 22.20. This was done on July 20, 2024. She has to put out her all. If she's unable to get below that 22 seconds barrier, she may be in some trouble. I might not find herself in the finals, but if she's able to do that, then you can expect great things from her. Not necessarily on the podium. However, once you make it in the finals, you stand a chance. And so Daryl Nita is one of the persons with the six fastest time who's going to the Olympics from Great Britain. And at number seven, Sherika Jackson. She's run sub 22 on multiple occasions over this year so far she has run a time of 22.29 seconds and this was done on june 30 2024 um so sherika jackson has a lot to do um remember she felt some cramps earlier and she had to pretty much put a halt on proceedings and have to seek medical help and ensure that she will be able to represent the country well at the olympics um she's pretty much second fastest 200 meter runner alive um, so of all time so we're pretty much expecting great things from her so let's see what Sherika Jackson have in store 
I've actually left out the number 8 slot for you, our fans. Who you think would make that number 8 slot? In fact, would you arrange any one of these proceedings are the persons we are expecting to make it to the finals? Who you have? Leave our comments in the section below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And to tell a friend, tell another friend, tell all of their friends to come and join our channel. This has been another episode of Sports Down the Middle. Be blessed.